is it time for you to ditch the home workouts and join the gym? Because let's face it, home workouts are a massive limitation unless you've got a sick gym in a basement or something like that. So let's explore why that is. Now this one applies more to beginners, but when you're a beginner, it's crucial to feel safe and supported. Gyms are full of machines which provide a lot of external stability. So that means they're an excellent choice for you to challenge the muscles that we want to challenge without there being so much of a limitation on your skill and setting up the movement. For example, doing a push-up requires a lot of internal stability, core strength, and the perfect setup to ensure that we're targeting the muscles correctly. Any mistakes can easily lead to fatigue setting in earlier, preventing the target muscles from reaching failure, or heaven forbid, you might get injured. However, a chest press machine removes all of these factors, it provides external stability, it provides a correct arm path and the line of push, and this makes it much easier to target the intended muscles and take them close to failure, which is essential for you getting stronger and building muscle. So that's point number one. Progressive overload is a fundamental principle in you getting stronger and building muscle and it involves gradually increasing the stress placed on the body during exercise to continuously make gains, get stronger, build muscle strength and endurance. So here's essentially how it can work. You can increase the weight, so gradually lifting heavier weights over time. You can increase the reps, doing more repetitions of a particular exercise and you can increase the number of sets so adding more sets of an exercise. The other thing you can do is improve your form, so enhance the quality of each repetition, and this is gonna ensure better muscle engagement, or you can make the movement harder. Now, when you're at home, it's pretty hard to progressively overload exercises using body weight or light dumbbells. For example, push-ups are gonna help you build muscle and strength in the early days, but once your chest gets strong enough, it might become a lot more impractical to overload push-ups within a certain rep range. So the next thing that you can do is try and make the movement harder, so maybe progress to one arm push-ups, but that's gonna place an even bigger demand on your internal stability, on your skill, and you might need to develop the skill for a period first before you can start to actually overload that pattern. So if you're someone who's got ambitions of getting stronger, building muscle as efficiently as possible, this might not be the best way for you. So that's why it might be time to get hold of some heavy dumbbells or maybe move on to something like the bench press. So at home you're usually limited by equipment and this makes it very difficult to manipulate the ranges in which we can train the muscle. For example, to train the shortened range of the triceps, you need your arms by your side and your shoulders in a depressed position. To train them in a lengthened range, you need them overhead. Now this is gonna be very difficult and impractical to achieve at home, but very easy to achieve in a gym using a cable machine, for example. Home workouts and leg days can only take you so far. Training the biggest and most powerful muscles in the body is gonna require a significant amount of external load. Now, right at the start, your body weight squats gonna be enough, but one day, they will need to become barbell squats. Your lunges, they're gonna need to become Bulgarian split squats. Your glute bridges, they're gonna need to become glute ham raises or hip thrusts. For example, if we focus on the quads, to train them in the lengthened range, a Bulgarian split squat is gonna be a good move. But to train them in the shortened range, the leg extension is pretty much gonna be the only exercise that's gonna do the job. So again, important to be able to access the right tools for the job. Training at home is not gonna be the best way for you to do that. Home workouts, bodyweight workouts, they might be convenient at the start, but to make real progress and to get the most out of your body, to get stronger, build muscle, get leaner, you need to ensure that you've got the right tools for the job. And these are gonna ensure that each movement and muscle is trained at an appropriate level for you. And also it's gonna to help to keep you safe and perform movements effectively. Now, unless you build a gym at home, joining a gym is gonna be your very best option. What are your thoughts on that? Let me know in the comments below. Otherwise, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.